of Kentucky basketball standout Terrence Clark has died after a car crash in Northridge. At just 19 years old, the freshman guard was preparing for the NBA draft just yesterday, signing with major sports agency Clutch Sports before tragedy struck. Tonight, new surveillance video shows the crash unfold at 2 o'clock this afternoon on Winnetka Avenue and Nordoff Street. Police say Clark ran a red light, slammed into another car before losing control, hitting a pole and a wall. He was the only person in the car. First responders rushed Clark to Northridge Hospital, where he was pronounced dead. The other driver was not hurt. Let's go live now to David Pingalore, who joins us in studio as the sports world is mourning tonight for the rising star. Yeah. Ping. And a young man has touched many lives with a bright future ahead of him. Tragically cut short, Terrence Clark was a highly touted prospect coming out of high school in Boston where he chose to go to the University of Kentucky over schools like Duke, Texas, and UCLA. Clark was limited to just seven games because of an ankle injury this year, averaging nearly 10 points per game. The 19-year-old was considered to be the city of Boston's best prospect in years, a gifted athlete. He was in Los Angeles getting himself ready for this summer's upcoming draft where he was projected to go into the second round. A number of athletes reacted to the news along with his former college coach, John Calipari, in a statement, he said, in part, a young person who we all love has just lost his life too soon, one with all his dreams and hopes ahead of him. Terrence Clark was a beautiful kid, someone who owned the room with his personality, smile, and joy. LeBron James, who was part of Clutch Sports, taking to Instagram, posting a photo of Clark, captioning the post, rest in paradise, nephew. Before entering Kentucky, he was ranked the eighth best high school basketball player in the country. This is a young man that touched many lives. Rick.